Open the Oculus app on your smartphone and make sure that your headset is nearby and is turned on. Tap on the Oculus Quest device. Go to More Settings. Go to Developer Mode and enable it. Go to the Oculus website and sign in using the same account as you have on your smartphone. Hover on Community and click Developers. On the left side of the window, click Manage. And click Create New Organization. You can name it anything you like. No one else can see this. Check I understand and click Submit. Check that box and click I agree. Go to SideQuest.com and download and install SideQuest for a Mac. The status of the connection between your computer and your headset is shown at the top left side of the SideQuest window. Now connect your headset to your computer via a phone USB cable. Do not use the same cable that came with your Quest. Now that you've connected it, it's gonna say unauthorized. This is the part where you allow USB debugging. So put your headset on and grant it permission by clicking Always Allow and then OK. Download the BMBF APK file. You can find the link in the description box. Now install it using SideQuest by clicking this button. Locate the BMB of APK file and click Open. You can see the status of the installation at the bottom part of the SideQuest window. Now that it says completed, you can now disconnect your headset from your computer and proceed to the next steps using your headset. Go to Oculus TV. and find the BMBF app under Unknown Sources. For some reason, other people don't have the BMBF app under Oculus TV after installing it using SideQuest. If you get this problem, just download the launcher below in the description box and install it the same way you installed BMBF in SideQuest. Then you will see it under Unknown Sources in your library. So let's continue with the installation. Click Continue. Click Uninstall Beat Saber. Click Patch Beat Saber and OK. Click Patch Beat Saber again. Click Install Modded Beat Saber. Click Settings. Scroll down a little bit. And allow installation of apps from unknown sources. Now go back to BMBF. Click Install Modded Beat Saber. Now that BMBF is fully installed, 
you can now start downloading your favorite songs. Just go to browser to see the available songs for download. And to download a song, just click this arrow down button. If you download a song twice, it's gonna say download failed, but the first one should go. You will know that a song download is being processed because it's gonna say processing just right below the unicorn logo. Click playlists to see everything that you have downloaded and when you're done, just click sync to Beat Saber. And you can now start playing by launching Beat Saber from here or from the library. So you see, it's very easy to add songs, but if you have any question, just leave a comment below. And if it worked, please let me know by giving this video a thumbs up.